Another head coach that is potentially on his way out, I guess, is mm. making moves. It is being alleged now by Manish. 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 Uh, Manish. Yeah. yeah. Manish. Meta, M-E-H-T-A, mm -hmm. at M-M-E-H-T-A-N-Y-D-N on Twitter. The Jets are trying to trade Le'Veon Bell per sources. We don't know if this is a factual statement, by the way. We have no idea. We don't, I don't, I didn't even know how to pronounce his name. I appreciate him. He has a blue check mark. Looks like, it looks like he knows exactly what he's talking about. Mm -hmm. But anytime uh -oh. these kind of get leaked out, you don't know if it's just the team leaking false information to get a taste of what their fans would think about it, a la what we we were told by former Marlins president uh, Dave Sampson Dave Sampson who said that he does that or used to do that as a president of the Marlins they would leak information out to the public just to get the team's fans response and then they would potentially do that I'm not saying the MLB and the NFL are the same but I would assume those particular moves are made on a regular basis that the public doesn't know about if the Jets are trying to trade Le'Veon Bell I don't think Le'Veon Bell's people would be upset about that mm. at all he got a contract that he set out to get he's not being used in a fashion that I think everybody thinks he should be fashion or used. And he liked tweets stating that he was not being used in a fashion that he should be used. Adam Gase, from all accounts, is a man that if you don't agree with him, get the fuck out. Even if we suck, you get out. I'll stay. If they trade Le'Veon Bell, this would be an interesting little piece to the story of the Adam Gase Jets era, which has been completely dysfunctional and unsuccessful, but good for Le'Veon Bell potentially getting out somewhere. He is currently owed how much money this year? So he is making 15 million this year. Ooh. I'm sure Ooh. there are some teams who might look at some footage of Le'Veon Bell from a couple years ago and say, is he that same guy? Uh, it doesn't appear as if he is. And is that because of the situation, how he's being used, or because Le'Veon Bell doesn't want to play football for the Jets team would have to make that decision they probably have to give something up and they would have to pay him 15 million dollars into the next couple years it seems like that is not probably likely but Le'Veon Bell if he has anything like he used to have inside of him is a player that some teams who might be on a run here who don't have a running back could potentially want yeah this has to be true because Lev Bell is good at football and if we know anything about Adam Gase he gets rid of all of his good mm -hmm. football players and by the way we've learned that if somebody has a down year as soon as they get out from underneath the Adam Gase umbrella they're going to have an MVP like oh, yeah. year the yeah. next year yeah. so maybe a team will pull the trigger strictly because of the gaze factor uh but that's a lot of money to pay a guy that hasn't had his best film in a couple years uh if so it is 15 this year but like next year i believe the dead cap's only like four and stuff like that so it, that's not bad at all to get levy on bell maybe somebody will take a shot who needs him who does it is levy on bell at the jets about to be something of the past that'll be a failed relationship which happens a lot with adam gase and with the new york jets it feels like yep.